uh-oh, I'm still on my trip. Did the foraging update come out? I wouldn't know. I'm not home. But I still wanted to make a video for you about why the Colosseum is never, ever, ever going to come back to Hypixel Skyblock, at least not in its original state. But before we talk about that, I want to talk about this video's sponsor, Opera GX. I've worked with Opera a lot before, so I'm sure you've heard me say that Opera GX is the first ever browser made for gamers. Opera GX is also available on mobile, GX Mobile, and can be connected to the desktop version. Opera GX has a lot of cool features for gamers. It can limit a bunch of things so that your PC doesn't run like garbage. It has a lot of social media function. But the main things I want to talk about today are how easy it is to switch to. And that is because of the quick import tool. Opera GX is equipped with an import tool that allows you to quickly import every setting from your previous browser, like browsing history, bookmarks, and cookies. All you have to do is go into the settings, scroll all the way down to synchronization, and you are able to select exactly what you want to import from your previous browser as simple as that. You can see my entire bookmarks bar from my other browser is here, and I can just go to the Hypixel forums if I want to, just because it was already a bookmark. While Opera does have its own extension store, it also is able to use Google Chrome extensions. All you have to do is go to the Chrome web store like you normally would, press add to Chrome, and then just add it to Opera instead, and you can have that extension right there. Opera GX is a phenomenal browser to have if you're just trying to make sure that your gaming experience is as good as possible. So if you're interested in downloading Opera today, go in the description below and download it for free. Now, let's get into the video. Way back in 2019, when Hypixel Skyblock released, the Colosseum was used as a PvP arena where you could either just come in here normally and fight a lot of people, or you could queue up at this NPC right here and 1v1 people specifically. This was a kind of fun area, which just ended up with endgame players stomping on a bunch of early game players who literally could not touch them when it came to killing ability. Eventually, in August of 2020, this did get disabled and it has not come back since. I've seen a lot of comments talking about how they want to test weapons here, how they just want to have fun in AFK here. Now the admin should definitely bring it back, but in this video I'm going to go over exactly why the Colosseum and features similar to it will never return to Hypixel Skyblock. The main and pretty much only reason why this feature is gone is because of Skyblock Gems. Skyblock Gems are the premium currency that you can buy. You can use it on cookies, you can use it on skins, you can use it on a lot of stuff, but Skyblock Gems actually killed the Colosseum. To understand why gems killed the Colosseum, we have to look at the End User License Agreement for Minecraft, or the EULA. This is a document that all players and servers need to follow, but we're mainly going to be looking at the server part and what they're allowed to do when it comes to monetary things. If we dig into this, you're going to see that servers are allowed to sell entitlements that affect gameplay, provided they do not adversely or negatively affect another player's experience and they do not give a competitive gameplay advantage. A competitive gameplay advantage is something that, given identical skill levels, time investment, and circumstances, can cause one player or group to perform better than another. Be aware that certain games or game modes can be designed as non-competitive, such as PvE games, and become competitive by adding gameplay elements such as a leaderboard. Hypixel at its core is a business. When you are running a PvE game like Skyblock that could compete with a lot of games on Steam charts, you definitely want to monetize that, and if they kept the Colosseum, they would not have been able to sell Skyblock gems, because even though it doesn't seem competitive, there's no rewards from the Colosseum, at least there weren't, it's still something that could negatively harm another player's experience, and it means that they can't have it, they can't have any kind of PvP like that. This is also why, even though they intended to do it, they had it on the alpha, they could not actually do the Elite 500 leaderboard, because the Elite 500 would also be affected by Skyblock gems in some way or another. So they just don't do leaderboards like that anymore. With how they have it set up right now, Skyblock is not considered competitive at all, because although you can get better items and better loot and run faster with that better stuff, you're not adversely affecting anyone else by doing things faster. The only adverse effect is that the economy of the game would maybe shift if people are doing things a little faster than you, but that isn't actually competitive according to the Minecraft agreement. Eventually, yes, I do believe that the Colosseum will be coming back in some way. I mean, you can see that they put a pool of water in here. They've been changing it ever since it got removed, 
but it's definitely not going to come back with anything similar to what it was. If I had to guess, it'll be like a wave-based area where you're going to fight off different mobs and just PvE creatures because PvP has no place in Skyblock. If you're interested in playing PvP, go play a game mode that is based on PvP. Go play the pit. Skyblock is not where you're looking for that PvP experience. So yeah, don't expect any kind of PvP or competitive things to show up in Skyblock unless Minecraft changes its end user license agreement because Hypixel's not trying to get shut down and they are trying to monetize this massive, massive server. So that's going to be it for the video. Let me know what you guys think about this down below. Are you mad that the Coliseum's not going to come back? Do you want a PvP in Skyblock for some reason? I, I'm interested in hearing what you guys have to say, but that's it for the video. I'll talk to you in the next one. Peace out.